everyone. I just wanted to post a quick video because after Raina shared the photo of the top team builders and team leaders in the Lux Republic, I got a lot of questions around how I build my volume. In April, I had over 30,000 points in my weak leg, and that's because I specifically focus on building my weak leg. I do two things in particular to help me build that volume. But before I get there, I just want to point out that there are different goals that you can have in Beachbody and different strategies to get there. For me, my first goal obviously is to help people. And I think that's one reason why I have become as successful as I am is because I always lead with the intention of helping versus making that sound. I think that's true for all of us in this business. But beyond helping people, to me, I think that there are really three main goals that you can set for yourself. You can choose to advance rank and be the number one coach or anywhere among there. Um, you can also choose to advance rank and be star diamond. So not necessarily the number one coach, but uh, two star, five star, 10 star, 15 star. That's a separate goal. Or you can really choose to make as much money as you can. Obviously, when you do one area, if, when you succeed in one area, it helps all of those areas. So if I build a diamond, I'm going to advance in rank, or if they hit success club, I'll advance in rank. But there's definitely different strategies for each one of those. If my goal is to make as much money as possible, right now in my life, I am drowning in student loan debt. And so Yes, top coach sounds really cool, and elite sounds really awesome, and I would love to build more diamonds. That's definitely a focus of mine, but my priority is paying off those student loans. So you do that by, for me at least, my strategy is building up my weak leg. The My strong leg has a lot of volume in it, so I need to match my weak leg volume to get the most bonus that I can every single week. What I do to build my weak leg is, first of all, it's about the placement of coaches. I, for every single coach, you have to decide if you put it on your left or your right leg. I put three coaches on my left leg, which is my weak leg, to every one coach on my strong leg. Sometimes I'll put four coaches on my weak leg. A lot of them are discount coaches, so it's not consistent volume, but some of them are really good coaches, and I just make sure I add at least three to four before I add one to my strong leg. So that's the first thing, is just stacking your coaches on your weak leg. The second thing is investing in those coaches. Any discount coach I have immediately goes to my weak leg. But there will be discount coaches and other types of coaches that want to actually work the business. And you have to invest time in them. You have to help them hit success club. You have to help them become emerald. You have to help their coaches become emerald and whatnot. You just have to be available for them. Give them your time to the ones that do want to work the business. When you stack your weak leg and then invest in those coaches, that is when volume happens because you get the volume from those coaches and their downline or their clients or whatever that they're working with. So I hope this was helpful. That's just my personal goal is to make money right now. So if that's not your goal, this may not be that helpful for you. If it is, that's exactly what I do. There's no real tricks to it. It's just my personal strategy. So if you have questions about that, I'm always open to answer them for you. Otherwise, keep going. There's a lot of awesome people on this team that are also doing well that weren't necessarily recognized. So just keep up the good work, and let's have an awesome May. Bye, guys.